jewelry still wants. Maybe we'll go there one day. Maybe one day when my mind isn't so wrecked with questions. Like, why haven't we gone back to the moon? Who makes those packaged peanuts? And why do they hate me? Huh? Huh? I was sitting at my office desk, just imagining what it's all about. You know, what it's really all about. And then she walked into my life. She had games I could go on for days. And I had a calendar. And one of those sharpies to make the X's and all those squares. You'll get lost after my body later. Right now, you've got an important case. That's why you're here, Cynthia, to always drop a case on my lap. Whether I want to or not, why are all the people morons in the world? I don't f***ing know, but listen up. Somebody stole a cigarette butt from the ashtray. I knew who it was right away. I could smell it a mile and two feet away. Everybody suspects it was Claire, but maybe you can figure it out. Why are you always coming to me, Cynthia, with the world's problems? Because I love you. I knew right away that she was a freak. <laughs> In the sheets and on the streets, baby. <laughs> But I hate you, you big ape! Oh, that's no concern of mine, Cynthia. Good gravy and hot biscuits! What's that? Somebody put a jar of piss on my desk. I don't know who it was, but I was willing to find out why. So I got in my car, and I drove off. I pulled up right to the scene. I got out of my car, and I walked over to the crime scene. Yeah, I could see there was a missing cigarette butt. It was missing, all right. And I wanted to know who did it. What are you doing out here? Do you know anything about this? Yeah, I patrolled the scene that night. I remember it like it was yesterday. And I swear to God, if you ever touch that swamp, I'll know what'll happen to you! <laughs> no, I don't! <laughs> well, it's too horrible to mention, so you better not do it. Catch you later. Douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> and I knew right away that he was dicking me around like a downtown clown with a sad, sad frown. My father always told me that you can't mix work and fun unless you're a clown. And I was willing to prove him wrong. Hey, doofus. What? It was Claire, okay? Everybody knows it was Claire. He's the one that sniffs the cigarette butts. He's the one that did it. And I knew right away he was trying to tell me something. Something very important, but I didn't know what it was. And I wanted to find out why. And I was right outside of my next suspect's house. So I knocked on the door. Detective Bailey, homicide police! Oh! Come in! There's a cigarette butt missing from the ashtray. Well, everyone knows that Claire does that sort of thing. He's a freak. I wouldn't know anything about that. Now leave me alone, I'm watching my programs. And I knew right away that she was an addict. <laughs> she didn't know nothing. So I decided to ask Claire to see what was up. Detective Bailey, homicide police. Oh, 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 this is it. When he got there. Oh, 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 an orange tube of some kind. I knew he was lying. <laughs> he was lying right through his teeth. Huffing that tube like it was yesterday. Why don't you get out here and leave me alone? Spill the beans! You know something! Oh, okay! <laughs> I'll talk. There's no soft drink. What kind of soft drink? Hey, uh, it's supposed to kick your ass. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. You gotta get naked to try it. You gotta get naked. Oh, yeah. Moving Q68. And I knew right away it was a shameless plug for a soda that nobody knew existed. And then it hit me like a ton of bricks. It was Cool B Jazz. No, it wasn't, dude. It was Andy the Delivery Guy. Oh, not me. It was Mr. Halloween. <laughs> no. Then it was Ted Buckman. Oh, my God, you're so stupid. And it was Walter then. It was Claire. But I guess that mystery won't go unsolved. And who left this jar of piss over here? I guess we'll never know that either. Do you know why? Because one of these days we'll find out what it's all really about. And then maybe we won't ever wonder so much. Why there is love. Why things are sometimes green. And why sometimes things are purple. 
Who knows all the answers? Do you? Huh? Smell the beans! Don't you ever wonder? 